afternoon. Happy Friday. Thanks for joining us on Midday Kentucky here with Maria Montgomery. Excited to be here. I'm Glad always to be back. It's, yeah, I know. I miss you when you're gone. It's another Friday ritual. I feel like it's our thing. It is. I so wish it was an time. everyday ritual. But yeah. It is a fabulous Friday. It is. Like, it's a special it's a, weekend. Well, it's a great weekend. It's beautiful out. It is. Finally, the rain is gone. I'm going to say that and it's going to start raining again. But right now it's gone, so I'm happy to enjoy it. It's a beach day. I mean, it's a pool. But we're in Where Lexington. Where are we? We're, we're, I mean, the pool. <laughs> <laughs> but it's there's so different. much going on, so I'm glad it stayed sunny. The same. Finally. Yeah. It's officially summer, so it's about time. How have you been? Good. It's been a while. Yeah. You know, good, catch busy. Us up, catch us up on your life. Oh, you know, just working and the regular. So <laughs> it's good, though. I'm always happy to be here with you. You seem so busy here as well. And Yeah, we know, have a I good show today. Yeah, good lots show. of fun stuff because it's a big weekend in Lexington. So we're going to keep you cued in on all that jazz and um, get you some fun stuff. Maybe dance. Maybe. Um, I have a life update. Okay. It's very, very important. Okay. Probably about a month and a half ago. <laughs> you already know this, but I don't know if okay. you know the update. Uh -oh. I discussed with David that I finally sucked it up and bought a couch. <laughs> That's a but, huge life update. But it was online. Because yeah. remember, I've been talking we talked about this. We've about been talking about this online. for like a we year. Have been. It's been like it's a, a year. Huge decision. So and I think I even texted you that night. You did. And it was probably like you one o'clock in the morning. <laughs> and I was like, Maria, I have a couch coming. And how long have you lived in Lexington? A long time. Well, I've had couches. It's just I needed to update. Oh. And okay. th but this is the thing. I really want to. Okay. You order it. I went through this entire process. Everybody's like, you bought a couch online. <laughs> Would you do it? Yeah. Like Wayfair. Okay. Hello. Big thing. Ship free. Thank you. And without like sitting on it or anything. <laughs> yeah. Because you can like return it probably. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know either. I feel like there's a way around. But that. everybody has looked at me and been like, that's the stupidest thing ever. And apparently you can get like swatches to see if the yeah. color matches. Yeah, no, just I've jump right in. Yeah, I just jumped in. Horse. Yeah. Did you get purple? That could show up purple. <laughs> I don't oh, know. It hasn't come in yet. No. Okay, well, so anyways, okay. when you order it, it says like two weeks. This is what I was really upset about when this all went down. Okay. Then once you order and you put it in, it comes <laughs> up that it's going to be like a month and a half. And so I called the people because that's what I do. And I was yeah, like, excuse me, but this is fake. <laughs> and they, they're trying to explain this process to me that it goes here, 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 and here. Okay. And I was like, tricky, tricky. Huh. But it takes like a month because it has that to come stinks. to your city on a train. On a train. Yeah, my couch, my couch has had a good journey. I guess that makes sense. I mean, a, an airplane would be a little difficult. Maybe. It doesn't or get the private plane. jet. Yeah. I, I mean, really, you, I should have requested that for the couch. <laughs> um, so then it comes to your city and you get the, the local movers to bring it in. Uh-huh. It's in my city. It's here. Yeah. So where does it hide out before it gets to you? I don't know yet. So I got an email. But this is the thing. I'm kind of anxious because I was really worried about getting it in the first place. And it's supposed to come this weekend, uh -huh. but I think I'm going to push it back just Why? to just to enjoy the thrill oh for a little gosh. longer. You know you have a really crazy life when... <laughs> <laughs> your first discussion is about a couch and the thrill you're of waiting for it to come in. You're super excited about your mail yeah. order couch. Yeah. Mail order it's not couch. a little one either. Like this is a, I don't I, I'm kind of I'm actually more curious to see if it if it's a good thing. Let me know, please go on Facebook or social media and let me know if you've ever made like a big furniture purchase online. Mm -hmm. Yeah, without trying it out. Yeah. So I would. I mean, as long as there's a return policy. I'm that way with clothes. I mean, I'll buy anything if there's a return policy. Listen, if I return this thing, I'm not going to have a couch until next January. Oh, Because well. it'll probably take a month to get but back and then stores. another month to get back. There's other stores. Girl. Why did you choose online in the first place? Because you know I don't, I don't want to go. No. I, 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 that's too, I'm too lazy for that. <laughs> <laughs> it's too easy to just push buttons. Yeah, I agree. But yeah. you'll get to try yeah. it out. So <laughs> that's my exciting news for this weekend. We have some more exciting news. Uh -huh. I didn't know this until yesterday. Actually, Jessica, our photographer who is in the studio, informed awesome. me, which I probably should know since I do the news every day probably. and the lifestyle show. Do you watch reality shows? I know where you're going here. So I, you knew. I did know because I shot at the castle. Is that what you're talking about? Yeah. Okay, good. I shot at the castle this week, and they were there. Like, we were, like, just crossing paths. Oh. Are now you, I, Are you guys like this now? So... So we're talking about Vanderpump Rules, and Brittany and I used to compete in pageants together way back oh, when. Oh, that's right, because she is yeah. from here. Yes, she is. So um, was there some animosity while no. you were at the castle? No. Were you, like, hiding? Like, hey, I remember that one time. <laughs> who beat who? <laughs> no. <laughs> Not at all. Um, <laughs> yeah, actually, I kind of lost touch with her, and so I heard that she had a TV show 
Um, I had no idea. So I actually was told that from my friends in Chicago. So they said that they loved Vanderpump Rules whenever they found out I was from Kentucky. So um, who knew that was a thing? I didn't, I hadn't watched it until I found out. And then, of course, I looked it up. And um, she's super sweet, though. Yeah, she really no, is super sweet. But yeah, so they're getting married this weekend at the castle. So is um, there a big hoopla going on? There is. There? They, let's see, I shot on Wednesday there, and they had just got there and like completely full parking lot. Bravo had their um, drones like in the air doing, oh. I guess, B roll or whatnot. Right. So um, full force for sure. They're they're going at it. Now, well, I will say Brittany was blonde when we used to compete, so there's that. Oh, but, yeah. Oh, Brittany. Yes. So did you get an beautiful. invite? Um, you know, I'm just deciding not to go. I'm just <laughs> You're busy here this today weekend. instead. Because isn't <laughs> so the wedding busy. today? Just so, oh, the wedding today. Saturday. Oh, I thought so too. I Brit should be able to tell you since Look I'm at invited. this. I need this. <laughs> we need one of these in the studio. Yeah, that's magical. Brittany, let us. Okay, sorry. No, we're going I won't be on, unfortunately. But um, yeah. Well, apparently they've been kind of shooting around town and yeah. all that kind of stuff. Oh, have they like downtown? I, I guess, guess that makes sense. I, I'm, I'm sure they have because they're making the most of it. It was a huge crew that was there on um, Saturday. So I think the studio is falling um. apart. <laughs> I don't know what's going on right there if you heard that. <laughs> I'm not sure if that came through the TV. I think but, it's just uh, the extra jurisdiction yeah. that's a heads up on the wedding. <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> uh, hopefully, uh, maybe they'll be out and around and yeah, enjoy Lexington. So. Exciting for the People city. that watch the show are all about it. So, Jessica. It's a thing. All right. <laughs> this story, I think, is kind of funny. Um, whether you're a reality star, whether you are on TV, whether you're just a girl, a lot uh -huh. of people love lashes. Uh, yes. And so um, you can either do the extensions, uh -huh. which obviously are not supposed to come off. Correct. They're attached to my face as we speak. So that's easier. Mm -hmm. But then they have the adhesive strips as well. Yes. So it's always a dilemma if you have fake eyelashes. And I'm just going to say, you stay at somebody's house. Oh, yeah. And then they like fall off, or you take mm -hmm. them off, or whatever. Like, what happens? I've yeah. heard girls. <laughs> the other things like hair extensions. We'll get into that in a minute. Yeah, just pop those suckers out. I, that's another thing too. Yeah. Well, a lot of people all. are a little worried about how somebody's going to take that if they wake up and they see some lashes. Yeah. Online, okay. this girl, uh -huh. of course, tweeted a picture. I guess her boyfriend found her lashes. Okay. Put them on the dresser. Uh -huh. on a napkin and labeled which eye they go to right there whoa yeah. oh yeah. okay so I guess see that's sweet, i was think? reading the script earlier i thought he dated them like i thought it was like a, a keepsake which was a slightly <laughs> free <laughs> <laughs> maybe in either dna but he, he if they're lashes. just labeling them left and right i mean yes, Cinderella. <laughs> but okay okay so if he found those sitting on the napkin or whatnot um, I just like that you think he was keeping Yeah, them. I did. I totally did. I didn't read it he all the way. Like a hidden eyelash <laughs> fetish when he opens a drawer. And you know, there are those guys napkins. out there. Don't act like you don't have guys chasing you for your lashes. <laughs> I wish I did. <laughs> so, okay. So my question is, how does he know? Because, you know, if you take them off, you plop them down, you don't know which one's which. Exactly. Uh, you can tell. I mean, we can tell. But, like, he's... But he can tell. That's what I'm a little... I mean, I'm not concerned and, but, but about But if he it. can tell, why does he feel the need to label yeah, it? Yeah, exactly. What is he doing because, here? Because, you know, there's a short side and a long side, usually. I, I love that um, everybody, like, applauded him and Maria's like, what is wrong with this wants weirdo? Her DNA. <laughs> he's going to kill her. <laughs> and That's where her Maria's mind to goes. her lashes. Apparently. I don't know how I feel about this either. I used to have a girlfriend with hair extensions. You said um, what? A, a girlfriend with hair extensions. Okay. I've, I've always had a ton. Like permanent so ones attached? No, I guess, the, okay, I'm really, I know about lashes, but hair extensions yeah. have like different things. Oh, that I you know can, like, about everything. Well, can you clip, <laughs> can you clip them in? <laughs> yeah. Okay, so I had a girlfriend, we would go out. Okay. And as soon as she either got in the car, this was before like Uber or anything, yeah. she would just start pulling her like extensions oh, yeah. out. Oh, because I've done do that. Do they hurt a little bit? Um, they can be heavy. So um, this is full disclosure for everyone yeah. in Lexington. We don't <laughs> I shouldn't tell you this, but sometimes I may or may not wear them during the UK basketball games. Secrets out. Oh, um, that's sometimes. breaking news. <laughs> you, you watch the six o'clock tonight, lead story. It's going to be on there. Um, so there was a time I was leaving Rep Arena Literally, my car, first thing I do is pop them out. Because if it's a big game, I'll actually wear them. If not, right. I don't always. But anyways, and I'm Everybody not, I'm not good it, at people. hair. Everybody does it. Well, I'm not good at hair. And so they're already curled, so it's so much oh. easier from oh. like a professional. Can anyways. you go shopping for these? Yeah. Um, anyways, popping them out, literally turn around. There's a SUV full of guys that were at the game laughing. 
That was a good moment in my life. <laughs> like, it, was was a like, rough, it was a rough game, guys. I'm just, just pulling my hair out. My hair, <laughs> like left and right. Well, Murray is life. It's like, and then I found an eyelash attached to my console. There you go. We're very glamorous. Yeah. In real life. It's super put together. Very yes. glamorous. Did yeah. you take a picture and tweet that? No, I should have. Yeah. I should have tweeted the, the guys laughing or something, but let it was us gone know so if you fast. have any horror stories on that. Then none of them are horror. They're all funny, I yeah. think. But I have no heard shame. guys like say they 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 take home a girl one night and then yeah. the next morning there's like hair all over here, hair <laughs> over here. I don't know impression? about like date night. I would like only like photo shoots for me. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Full disclosure. Yeah. Let us know. Okay. We um <laughs> again lead story.